got a remodeling project or maybe a new home construction project that involves drywall, almost every single one does, and what else is involved? Switches, electrical outlets, cable TV boxes, any number of things that are in the wall. What you have to be aware of that behind each little switch and each receptacle, there are these little rabbit ears. And the back of the rabbit ears needs to be flush with the surface of the drywall for a really nice, tight, professional fit when you're done. Here's how you go ahead and repair it. Make sure that you blow any dust and loose drywall out of the way first. A lot of people make a mistake and just make a simple swipe of the material and then smooth it over with a cross stroke and think that's OK. That's where you're running a problem because generally only the front edge of the drywall mud is actually getting a good bond with the joint compound. The better way I like to do it is actually kind of goop the mud in around the, the hole, uh, take your knife and tap it into place, make kind of a mess, it's not a problem, get the joint compound contact in the plastic box, then take your final swipes and it's going to really make a good bond so that your electrical outlet and your switches fit nice and tightly. Remember. All you have to do is get it messy, jam it down in there, give it one final swipe. It's going to look really great, and those plugs and outlets are going to stick just fine. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to askthebuilder.com.